Musicians like the Beach Boys and the Beatles have recorded albums inside this Hollywood studio. But the 13 story building itself is one of the most unusual structures in the world. In tonight's Look at This, KKL 9's Desmond Shaw has more on the Capitol Records building. Well, take a look at this. It is yet another very famous Hollywood building, very recognizable from the 101 freeway here on Vine. It is the Capitol Records building. Built in 1956, and did you know that this 13-story building was apparently the world's first circular office building? And we look at the design, and a lot of folks say that it looks like a big stack of records with a gigantic spindle on top, like it's a record player. But that was apparently just a coincidence. That was not commissioned by Capitol Records or anything like that. It just kind of ended up working out. This is also the home of the Capitol Studios, where so many of the most famous recording artists in the world have recorded. Frank Sinatra, Nat King Cole, The Beach Boys. And according to DiscoverLA.com, those famous echo chambers that are 30 feet underground can produce a reverb of up to five seconds. And most famously, you can hear that on The Beach Boys' good vibrations. Out here, this section of the Hollywood Walk of Fame that extends in front of the Capitol Records building, these are a lot of the most famous musicians of all times. All four of the Beatles have stars out here. One of my favorite bands of all time, Duran Duran. They have their star right in front of Capitol Records. Seeing them at the Hollywood Bowl this summer, cannot wait for that. You can't go inside Capitol Records, the building. It's not open to the public, but of course you can walk up to it, admire the really cool, unique architecture, and of course you're surrounded by the stars of very famous musicians out here on Vine, just south of the 101 freeway. Taking a look at this from Sky 9, I'm Desmond Shaw. And if you'd like Desmond to take a look at something interesting in your neighborhood, just write us at look at this at cbs.com.